A changing magnetic flux through a coil or loop of wires causes an EMF. The EMF is the induced potential difference given by volts, capital V. Uh, Faraday came up with this EMF, or volts, is equal to negative n. So little n is number of loops per meter times by the change in the magnetic flux over change in T. Uh, you can also write this because, remember, we learnt the flux formula. So we can substitute, instead of flux, we can write... B, magnetic field strength, times A. Does anyone remember what A is? Area of the loop. Remember we talked about loops? Times cos theta. Theta was the angle between the loop and the flow, yeah? Uh, the formula sheet has this formula. So EMF equals negative N delta B times A perpendicular to the flow, so that it's basically the area of the loop and all of the flow is passing through that loop. Do you remember I talked about that? Yeah. So you get a loop and you got all of the flow passing through. Write down what formula? EMF equals negative, negative capital N over L times change in B A, this one, because it's right angle change in T. I'll do the cos version. N is number of turn loops. So we got one, one per meter, and we got change in B. Four minus one microteslas times by what's micro? Negative 3 times A times cos. It's cos 0. 3375 volts. 